Double factorial. Today we are going to discuss about double factorial, which is also called semi factorial of a non negative integer. In my junior college, I used to think 6 double factorial is equal to 6 factorial factorial. But later I realized it is not like that. Unlike the concept of usual factorial, it works differently. So let's discuss what is the concept of double factorial. Factorial for any non-negative integer is a product of all the integers from n to 1. In order to define double factorial for any non-negative integer, we should know whether n is even or odd. Because basically there are two cases. Case 1, when n is even, if n is even, then n double factorial is n, n minus 2, n minus 4 and so on and the n, uh, last value would be 4 and 2 if n is even. Whereas if n is odd, n double factorial is n, n minus 2, n minus 4 but the last value would be 1, 3, 1. In short, we can define double factorial as a signum function n factorial is equal to this for n is even and double factorial is equal to this when n is odd. The special cases and double factorial is 1 in two cases when n is 0 and 1. So we can say 0 double factorial is also 1 and 1 double factorial is 1. So let's take some examples. For example, 6 double factorial. So if uh, 6 double factorial, what is n here? n is 6. 6 is even. So if it is even, 6 and subtract 2, that is 4. Again you subtract 2, 6 double factorial is 6, 4, 2. So last number would be 2 only if n is even. So it would be 24 multiplied by 2, that is 48. So we can say 6 double factorial is 48. Whereas if we try to find 6 double factorial like 6 factorial and again factorial then 6 factorial we know that it is Six uh, factorial is 720 and 720 factorial imagine the complication if we try to find it it is beyond the limit so it is actually not 6 double factorial is definitely not 6 factorial factorial let's try one more example 7 double factorial as 7 is an odd number so for odd number 7 subtract 2 5 subtract 2 3 subtract 2 1 but 1 is the end point okay let's multiply 105 so 7 double factorial is 105 well if you want to define double factorial in sigma notation it can be defined and double factorial is k equals to 1 to n by 2 to 2k is equals to n n minus 2 n minus 4 up to 2 and n double factorial for odd number k equals to 1 to n plus 1 by 2 2k minus 1 is equals to n n minus 2 n minus 4 into 3 to 1 I hope this concept you understood, enjoyed, thank you for watching and for more tricks, techniques and details, subscribe my channel, that's easy, bye bye, take care.